What is going on ladies and gentlemen, Monkey Flop here and today we're going over the PlayStation 4, PlayStation Store deals and offers of the week for the EU side of things and we got mega discounts. Well, according to PlayStation, let's be the, I'll let you guys be the judge of that. Let's go ahead and browse through the mega discounts and uh, let me know your guys' feedback in those comments. So we have the Witcher 3 Wild Hunt. For $749. We got Rage 2 on sale for $31.99. Marked down from $49.99. Um, we also got some sports, some um, Ghost Recons up in here. Uh, Beast Gang. Uh, Gang Beast? is That's actually the name. Sometimes I read things backwards. Don't! Um, Doom and Wolfenstein 2 definitely do recommend if you guys like fighting games. These are a little bit older. We've seen on sale um, for a lot less than this, but nevertheless, it's on sale. Um, so if you guys are planning on taking advantage of it, let me know in those comments down below. We got Grand Theft Auto, the trilogy. Um, these are PS2 classics brought over the PlayStation 4. Batman Arkham's uh, also on sale, a bunch of those. LA Noir. this is a remaster from the PlayStation 3. Shadow of Mordor, Game of the Year Edition is on sale for $9.99. That's pretty cool. Uh, we get NBA 2K19 for $24.99. Original price $84.99. <laughs> when I see prices like that, it kind of like you know breaks my heart. But nevertheless, pretty good deals to say the least. Let's continue on, shall we? So, um, there's a lot of different games on sale this week. Uh, very interesting stuff. If you guys like Digimon, Digimon is up in here. <laughs> but we also have some indie titles as well, um, which are pretty cool. Um, let's see what else we got in store for us. That's pretty much it for um, the mega sale. Was it really a mega sale? Let me know in those comments. Now let's go over the game under games under 13, um, which is pretty cool too. Um, these some of these games are kind of like gonna be repeated from like you know previous sales, but nevertheless we get Donut Country. Makes me want to have a donut now. I'm gonna go get some donuts. Who's with me? Nobody? Just me? I'm a fat kid. Okay, thanks. <laughs> yeah, 20, 20XX is a pretty cool game. I definitely did enjoy it. A lot of people were very excited about it because it definitely has, you know, uh, you know, inspired Mega Man. Um, but it didn't really hit home for a lot of people. Magicka 2 is, uh, you know, I always recommend that one. I just love it. Um, this game is very interesting. It's it kind of plays out like a comic book. Um, so if you're planning on like you know picking up something that's a little bit different, Metropolis um, is pretty cool. State of Anarchy, Masters of Mayhem. Uh, this game definitely looked fun when I first saw the trailers, but it never like really picked up. Um, Super Dungeon Bros. Um, you know a lot of people are into like co-op games and this is a good option, but uh, I, I can't like recommend it, um, you know, like to everyone. Uh, so watch some gameplay, see if it's your cup of tea, but nevertheless, it's a co-op game that's on sale. DayZ is on sale for $29.99. Um, how many people are gonna buy uh, DayZ uh, for $29.99? I think it should be less, to be honest with you guys. There's so many other free to play battle royale options. Um, but that's just my opinion. I'd love to know you guys' opinions in those comments down below. Um, don't get me wrong. Like, you know, th that game is awesome, but yeah, I don't know. The Evil Within is amazing. Wolfenstein, The New Order. Um, these are older games, but they're oldies but goodies. Um, Wolfenstein, old The Old Blood. This one's a little bit different, so make sure you guys watch the gameplay before you, you know, kind of jump into it. Amnesia Collection, uh... Dude, Amnesia is pretty freaking awesome, especially if you like the anime style of video games. Um, you're probably going to like this one. Transistors, it's just a beautiful game. Bastion is also a pretty cool one. That's a PS4, PS Vita bundle. Octodad, uh, a lot of people claim this was an easy platinum, but it definitely has like a learning curve to it. Uh, the gameplay mechanics are a little bit harder than what you probably are used to. 
I know when I jumped on it, I was like, oh, an easy platinum. Let me check this out. And I'm like, nah, not worth my time. There's some games where I'm just like, you know what? It's not worth, you know, going through the struggle of trying to platinum this game and just not having fun at all. Um, games are meant to be fun, and that that's the way it should be. Um, now, given I have uh, done some easy platinums, like Planet RIX 13. That's kind of weird that that just popped up while I was pl uh, talking about easy platinums. This one is a very easy platinum to get, and I actually really enjoyed it. But I like side-scroller puzzlers. Uh, do you? Let me know in those comments. Um, there, there's some other games that, like, this one here is an easy platinum, um, but I don't recommend it for that price. If you see it for 99, like 0 0.99, then definitely pick it up. Or if you're on the U.S. side of things, if you see it for less than a dollar, then um, that's a steal. But ladies and gentlemen, that's actually going to be the mega discounts. Games under 13, games under 4, and Daisy on sale as well. If you guys uh, did enjoy this video, make sure to hit a like, comment down below. Support your boy! And if you guys are new, please subscribe with those bell notifications turned on. And I will see you guys in the next news update. You guys are freaking awesome.